in midweek over in Ireland. Good debut performance from him. Brett Lee will have been itching to get into international cricket this summer. Out with a side injury for uh, the Ashes series. Gets his chance to perform now at international level. So, Brett Lee then with the first ball of the evening. So, the pad and that nearly came back onto leg stump. It might have just clipped thigh pad. Quite sure how close that was to the stumps. I'm looking forward to seeing Lee and Nanez and Mitchell Johnson bowl on this pitch. That looks so close to leg stump. See, it hits the bottom, almost the curved part of the thigh pad and almost came back onto the stumps. One of the worst ways to get out, probably apart from uh, maybe off the bowler's hand at the non-strikers then run out, but Vopara under pressure. Two slips waiting. Vopara away down to fine leg. England open their account. Had a, a break of something like 50 minutes due to start at about five past the this afternoon we just hope the umpires uh, will try and keep the players out it's only really been spitting with rain in that time nothing too major Joe Denley about to face uh, his first ball in international 2020 cricket Ken's opening batsman one of the next England batsmen off the rank Top edge and it's going to be our first ball. He is too quick for him. Brett Lee strikes straight away with a fearsome short ball that Denley can only parry to square leg. England are one for one. Well, it couldn't have been a worse start to your international career, really. That has definitely beaten him for pace and a very simple catch to Nathan Horrocks, a square leg. But Brett Lee back into the Australian team, strikes early for the Australians. And Joe Denley, a golden duck on debut. England, one for one. So we saw enough of this when England bowled. Watson and Warner struggling with the shorter ball as it appeared to skid onto them. This one has got to Denley in a flash. Right to the top of the bat. And just spooning up to Horrocks. Square leg, Denley beaten for pace and gone first ball on debut behind and it sort of skidded forward be a tough call but yeah Brett Lee does bowl a lot of no balls always close to that front line no field change allowed then so two slips stay in the two men out are at fine leg and third man and it's a free hit for Jonathan Trott slower ball beautifully bold beautifully bold deceive Trot. could only get a finish outside edge on this. Yeah, that's the new slow ball that Brett Lee has developed. It's definitely just seam up, and it just comes out a lot slower. He doesn't quite get his hand right behind the seam, but it definitely seam up, and as you saw that last one, swung a little bit. Very useful delivery from Brett Lee. There's a wide there's a flick of ball on shirt or thigh pad or something there. Let's have a look at that uh, slower ball that Lee bowled. This is the bowl, this is the free hit. Let's see if we can uh, detect how he's released it. Oh, what? Pretty well disguised then, isn't it? Yeah, I've seen it a lot of times now and I can't work out what he does, really. It's arm seems to come over at the same speed as a normal delivery. Nipping back. This is uh, Lee's proving a bit of a handful here. Already too much of a handful for Denley. And I just wonder whether a little bit of moisture on this surface has A quickened it up a bit and A allowed a little bit of movement as well. 
keep your eye on his speeds as well. That last one, 91.7 miles per hour. Lee's bowling quick. Red figures at uh, the bottom of the screen. A good first over. Better than good. Three for one.